Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is Kels, welcome. Uh, so I recently just had a birthday and I went to Europe and it was amazing. And uh, I decided that I was gonna get some keepsakes from every place I went to, because why not? Uh, so this is the stuff that I got for my birthday. I'm so excited to share all of it. A lot of the things I've been wanting that have been sold out in the U.S. Um, or they don't sell separately in the U.S. And I'll talk about that. And then I got something really exciting that I've wanted for years. So let's just get into the video. Uh, they are luxury things. So hopefully you like luxury stuff. Um, I just started getting to luxury because I'm finally making just enough to have a little left over so I could finally treat myself. Um, I've always liked, always liked luxury, but I couldn't always afford it. So, you know, yay for, you know, progress and doing better and all that stuff. All right, enough about that, let's get into it. So the first thing I wanna show you is what I got in Athens. So I went to Athens, I was there for a few days and it was beautiful. I went to the Theater of Dionysus and just did all the things. <laughs> and I got this cute little baby. Can you see that? Oh my gosh, so cute. So um, it's a, a threefold wallet from LV and it has the polar bears on it. It's so, I thought it was so cute. Cause I was like, oh, it's the mama bear and the baby bear, maybe a daddy bear, I don't know. Um, and so it opens like this and it has a nice red, sexy interior and then wallet and there are six holders six uh, card holders and then this little zippity doodah right there <laughs> I'm not gonna lie I don't remember the name the names of many of these things like this I cannot remember the name of this wallet I remember seeing it and just falling in love with it um, I'm not really a I must have the this thing unless I already want it and then I figure out the name of it. But this I just saw and I was like, this is so cute. Cute for the holidays. I love the red, easy to spot in the bag. Um, and so yeah, so that was the first thing I got in Athens. So the next place I went was Venice, Italy. And that was, <laughs> that was interesting. Uh, I could tell a whole story on that. That was so much fun. And so I got this little mini pochette. How cute. So it's in the monogram and it has little giraffes and they're, they have little bags. They have like the mama giraffe and the baby giraffe and they have their cute little purses and I thought that was so cute. I'm obsessed with like, I guess, mom animals and their babies. I don't know why. I don't have any kids. Um, but apparently I like animals and their babies. So uh, the inside is brown. And I've already been using, in case you see a little bit of dust or glitter or something, because what's life without glitter? <laughs> um, and I like that it's pink here. It's like so girly. Now, what's so fun about this, I put some like, it's like I use it as a key ball or catch all and I'll put it in my bag. But also if I want to be really compact, I'll take the chain from my fleecy, the gold chain, and I'll wear it. So like the chain, this chain will hang like this. And then I'll I'll clip the chain from the Felicia and wear it like a cute little crossbody, little like mini bag. I love this little thing because I've gotten so much use out of it since I've gotten it. So super excited about that. The next thing I got was something I've been wanting. I've been going to different Louis Vuittons and they keep seeming to be sold out probably because it's popular and it's this agenda. Uh, this is the medium-sized MM in the Demi Urbine, and I have my own pen in there that my dad got me. I think it was for a graduation like so long ago, uh, but I keep it because it's a beautiful pen. It's one of the cross pens, which are supposed to be pricey or something like that. So my dad gave it to me, so I've had it for many, many, many years. But not just that, I also got the, I don't know if you can see that, you probably can't. Can you see that? Probably not, but I got the the pages that come with it. Here, let me see if I can, uh, let's see. Boom, there we go. Yeah, so I love these things. 
And I love that they're like silver right here. I think that's so cute. I just like cute little things, I guess. Uh, so it has, I already have stuff like written in there, but you know, you're a, like how adorable is that? How adorbs. And then I added some things. So I had a Kate Spade one and it came with like these that say like notes. You see like notes and to-do lists and a contact list and all that. So I didn't actually really use those. So I just moved them over to this one too. They fit perfectly. Oh my gosh. So cute. And then if you're like, hey, what's that? Oh, I got it hot stamped because I knew that I wanted this. This is actually a gift. So I didn't get it hot stamped, but this is a gift. Um, and then this is from France. That's the other place I went. And this is from Greece. Those are my little patches. So that's my little baby. So yeah, super, super awesome. Sorry, just adjusting it a little bit there. I love it. Obviously, it's New Year. I've already started using it. It's a nice weight. It fits in a lot of different bags because it's MM size. And I write in my agenda every day. Um, the first was two days ago, so there's nothing for that. But there's already stuff for like these other other days. So that is my agenda. Okay, so after Venice, I went to Paris. And I went to the Chanel store on, uh, is it 30 Rue Cambon? I'm going to say that wrong. 31 Rue Cambon. I'm such a professional at buying, I guess. Uh, I'm not. I just get excited over well-crafted things that are also pretty that I can wear. <laughs> so I went to the iconic uh, Chanel store on 20, 31 Rue Cambon. And I got a few little things. So the uh, packaging is white, as many people know. It has, you know, I have the chameleon. It's a white box. Let me take this bad boy. It came wrapped up and everything, but I've already unwrapped all that. And I thought I saw these, and I thought they were so unique and so different. They're the little. I don't know. Can you see that? Can you see? There you go. Yeah. They um, are the little uh, arrow. Part of my nails are starting to grow out. My gel is growing out. Um, and they have the CC and what looks like a little pearl right here. They are so stinking cute and so different. And I was like, oh, wow, those are, those are different. And they have stones in them. No stones have fallen out, in case you are wondering. But uh, so that's that. My lighting is gonna keep changing. I have my lights, but my like camera keeps adjusting. So hashtag life. Okay, <laughs> next one. See it adjusts when I put something next to me. Chanel 31 Rue Cambon. Rue is straight. There's your language lesson for the day. All right. So. This one is a nice little brooch, and I started getting into brooches. And here, I'm gonna put it in front of the black the little thing. So, look at that bad boy. Can you see it? Can you see her? So, it says Chanel, obviously. And then it has a CC in the middle here, and then it's all, all stones all around. And I think it is so stinking cute. Like, you, know, you can wear two of them together like so cute and I don't have enough silver things so it's like I need to start buying more silver things so I got a silver brooch to wear with some of my like silver jewels and it's so cute I've already worn it I love it I'm not gonna pretend like I haven't already worn this stuff guys I have uh -huh. next one same place <laughs> kind of going doing these quickly because I don't know how long people want to sit and like watch stuff <laughs> so i have the little bag comes with the little care kit if you can see that and inside oh, another thing i've wanted is a nice little card holder it is the black caviar leather with the gold hardware chanel card holder and of course it comes with the card if i could stop fumbling around for a second 
authentication, authenticate, you know what, I, the authenticity card, okay? Um, so what's crazy is that I was thinking that this could only hold like maybe two in each one and then here, but it actually can hold a lot, which makes it so convenient. I've put money in here once. I love, look at that like dark, it's such a pretty color. Oh, and I love the black. It obviously goes with everything. It's sleek, especially when I want to use my little uh, bags, then I can. Sorry if you hear a scratching. That's my dog trying to get into the room. Um, that little booger. The next thing are some shoes. So I have this little camellia. This one's still wrapped up. So I'm gonna do an unboxing. Let's unbox this one, if I can get it open. Okay, so that's it right there. I've not had any shoes, and I thought this would be a great time to get some shoes. And I was trying to decide between two pairs, so I have the bags. I was trying to decide between two pairs, and everyone's like, that one looks really good on you. And I was like, yeah, I think I like this one more. And so I got these beautiful gray Chanel flats. They're so, oh, they still smell brand new like leather. Does anyone else like the smell of leather? I really do. So you can see the detail there at the toe. It looks kind of lavender, like in this light. It's not, it's gray guys, I promise. But yeah, Brad, I've not worn them yet, but I totes will. I'm super excited, super excited. They were so sweet there. Oh my gosh, I can't remember uh, the essay's name. She was so sweet. They were so busy. And one lady was like kind of helping me and then like wasn't really helping me. And I was like, okay, you're not making my shopping experience enjoyable. And so then I went to look at jewelry because whatever I was looking at, I. I don't know, I guess I didn't know if I didn't want it anymore or something like that. But I went to jewelry and somebody else came and helped me and I was so happy because I was just looking to buy like one little thing. But when it, and then this lady helped me and I ended up buying three other things just because I was like, oh, I really like this, I really like this. Oh, this is great. And she like helped and like brought out champagne um, because I was waiting for so long and wrote me a beautiful note in a card for my birthday. Um, and it was just so nice. It was just like, mm, you know, that little like, mm, that's how I felt. So they were lovely. And I really, really enjoyed my experience there with the second person. The first lady looks like she was so busy and like she helped. But I was just like, do you not think I have money? Is that what, is that what this is? Is that let's just say let's just say it um because you know that happens sometimes and I was just like all right well you know it is what it is so sorry changing my the lighting so I was like okay whatever you know do you somebody else will get this sales then I guess so that's what I got in Paris but I got one more thing I went to Yes, Gucci. I love their holiday packaging. Oh my gosh, their holiday packaging is so stinking cute. I don't know if it's I don't usually shop at Gucci during the holiday. Last year I bought something, but then I turned out I didn't really like it. So I brought it back. It looked too like old womanish. But this bag is super cute. I thought that was adorable. So let me show you what I got. Can you guess what it is? Can you guess what it is? Looking at Gucci for a bag. It's a bag. And a certain color and a certain size. And the US just never got it. And I mean nowhere. I went to California. Nope. Here in Arizona. Nope. <laughs> Chicago. Nope, nope. So I was just like, what? Like, Chicago's not small. Like, you know. Everywhere I was going was not like a small place. So I was just like, what is going on? U.S. never got it. So I have all kinds of papers and things wrapped in it. So let me unwrap it. I got... Oh, 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 this baby. How pretty. Can you see this blue? This cobalt... Oh, look at that. 
they're kind of like, they're like similar. My jacket's a little, a little extra. Um, but cobalt blue is like my favorite, favorite color of blue. I love turquoise. That's been my favorite color, but I realized in my wardrobe I have more cobalt because it's just like, it's like stunning, you know? Um, plus the gold hardware on top of that. So this is the Gucci Marmont bag in the medium in the cobalt blue. Now the medium does not come in a cobalt blue without, I think, designs on it. And they might actually not even have it, but I think they have like designs on it, but not like this. And so this, I was just like, oh, I love you. Get a, get a close up. Oh my God, I love it. You see some dust particles maybe? Cause I've worn it. So oh, here's the back. That's the back and the side. She's stuffed. She's stuffed. There's a little snappity. Snaps it open. I have all the stuffing in there. So I actually also, so they had some beautiful uh, gold ribbon that they wrapped around the box that I basically cut. So on the inside, I've actually, I actually tied this so that this will stay like that. And then I put some paper underneath here so it doesn't rub against this. So that's to keep the chain from moving while I'm storing it it does um and then here is the inside look at that gorgeous pink like satin interior that is gorgeous yeah so these are the little ribbons i put you gotta do what you gotta do to like you know keep your bag looking cute so i'm i've worn this bag already a ton i love this bag it fits a lot i'm trying not to overstuff it it fits a lot and um, I wear it like a double, uh, now it's moving. <laughs> I wear it like with both straps. I wear it with just this one, you know, as a shoulder bag, crossbody, all that. I love this. I worn it with a dress. I've worn it with something not casual, but like more casual. So not like a dressy dress, if that makes sense. Um, I've worn it with, what else have I worn it with? I don't know. So I had like like different outfits, not necessarily like an evening gown, et cetera, et cetera. So I love her. What should I name her? Bonnie Blueberry. Blue. I'll name her Blue. B-L-U. Okay. So Blue is going to go down here. So that is everything I got. I love that next one. I'm like, <laughs> every time I like see it and I open something that I have, I'm like, Oh, I love it so much and like appreciate it so much. And I'm just like happy to have it because I had to work so hard to get it. I basically just save up all year long. And then on my birthday, I have some fun and buy myself stuff that I want. They didn't get. So the fact that I'm like, oh, I wanted that bag for months and I saw it and I saved and I got it. And I'm just like, victory so it's awesome um okay enough about that so after paris i was in dublin yes dublin ireland and that was so much fun oh my gosh i gotta like i think i have some footage i have to like make a video about that about the different places and put some footage and talk about it because it was just so much fun um okay so when i was in dublin i got a couple little little things oh did i show you the packaging that louis vuitton has for the holidays you guys probably know that, right? The, can you see that? Why can't you see that? Oh, it's stuck. There we go. It's like the gold ribbon. I thought it was super cute. There's a lot of gold ribbon going on, so I thought that was adorbs. So, another thing, well, first thing I got in Dublin was this lovely, I've been looking for this also. It sells out because it's small. It's inexpensive uh, for the brand and everyone and their mother has one. So, uh, it is the... LV monogram key clay so cute it's like little look at that it's so little has this little thing now I have uh, a key holder I have a couple key holders already but this I love using for my extra cards because I know people use this for all, all kinds of things put your keys in here um, I would feel like you put your keys on this I just don't like the idea of just like, do you just throw your keys in here? Oh, here's the inside, by the way. It's that brown interior, it's wipeable. It's kind of like um, a mini pochette or what have you in it, but this is super wipeable. 
Um, I, yeah, I don't like the idea of putting my keys in here because I'd have to like put them in there separately. Plus I have a key holder. I love my key holder. Like it's amazing. I use it every day. So this I use for all like my extra cards, rewards cards, gift cards, coupons, cause you girl coupons. Cause I need to save my money. So I can buy the things I want. Um, so that's, that's it there. The monogram key clay. Okay. The next thing I bought is still here in the box. The normal uh, wrapping, which I think they should just do gold all the time. Though I like this better than the, the brown one. And this I've also been looking for in the US. In the US, they will not sell these separately. And you're gonna know what I'm talking about when you see it. This gorgeous, this gorgeous thing here. Oh, oh, oh just kidding, you can't see it. Oh, oh, there it is. Look at that, look at that, can you see? There we go. Look at that. Yep. Loved it. Uh, I wanted one so I can, you know, hot stamp it and put it on the bag. Because I do have the uh, Demi Arzur in um, the Neverfall and the MM. Though I don't think this is usually what you put on that bag. But... You know, it's mine, and so I'm gonna do with it what I want. But I thought it was so cute because I wanted one, and you just can't get it in the US. So while I was there, I was like, I know what, you know what, let me just pick one up. I'm gonna obviously get another bag at some point. Um, this way, I have this already. I had a bunch of different like sizes. They came in, I think, three different sizes, and at least the one, the store in Dublin, in by uh, Brown Thomas. They had three different sizes and two different colors. So this one and like the one that looks like the Demi Arbeen. So, super happy to get that. So I'm just gonna put this bad boy back in here because I've wanted that. And in the US, they're just like, nope. Unless you like have some great uh, relationship with a sales assistant, uh, associate, <laughs> sorry, associate, and you buy all the time, maybe you can probably get it then. But I'm just a regular girl that shops sometimes. <laughs> Uh, so I don't have those pleasures. Okay, so uh, after Dublin, the last stop was Barcelona. Yes, and I've wanted to go to Barcelona forever. So finally made it. It was on my list of things to do, my goals for last year. So I went to Barcelona and I got something that I have been looking for. <laughs> Let me show you the box it comes in. It comes in, or it came in this box. Maybe a little... I like Gucci's wrapping. I love, like, I keep every box, every ribbon, every bag, like, everything. Everything? Everything. I keep it all. So I got some that I've been searching for. I couldn't, you know, find it anywhere. I technically didn't find it, but you'll see what I mean. So it's in this bag, and you probably know what it is. Yeah, oh, <laughs> take two. Okay, <laughs> yes, it is the Gucci Marmont belt in the black leather. Uh, I've been trying to find this since, let me think, 2016, my birthday. <laughs> so it's been basically a year that I've wanted this belt. It's been sold out. And the size I needed was a 75 because all the pants I wear are high waisted. So I was like, I need the smallest one because my waist goes in. So um, apparently everybody's skinny these days and every <laughs> everybody basically had this belt or was buying this belt. And I was just like, can you skinny people stop buying up all the belts? Okay, I know you guys aren't wearing it high waisted. You just have tiny bodies. Okay, I'm jealous. Number one. Okay, number two, I want my belt. So I went to the Gucci store. I forgot the name of the street, but in Barcelona, and they had a bunch of belts. And this is actually the smallest one. I can't, it's not a 75, guys. <laughs> if you're laughing at me, like laugh. Oh, poop. I don't remember what this one was. I think this is like the 85 or something. So I was like off. It's like extra long. Um, 
But what I decided to do is just get it, get a few more holes punched. But a few, I mean like a lot of holes punched. So someone was like, hey, you can get somebody like a, a shoe smith or whatever leather guy to, you can cut it right here and then they can pull this part and then sew it up. But then I would lose all of this like writing. And I was like, maybe I'll still have them do that, but just have them do it so it doesn't touch the Gucci sign. So basically about an inch and a half. But I went to Gucci and I was like, hey Gucci, I bought this belt, you're awesome, please punch some holes. And they were like, uh, yeah, sure. So let's see, I don't know where she actually started punching the holes. So, okay, so you have the holes, right? And she was like, here, I punched two. Oh, I could punch three for you. And I was like, okay, still too big. And so she's like, okay. And so she punched another one. And I was like, okay, still a little too big. And she's like, I'm gonna get in trouble because it's gonna mess up the integrity of the belt. I'm like, ma'am. The intent, like the belt is fine. It's going to be mine forever. Like I'm going to wear the belt. I love the belt. I want the belt. I want the belt to fit. Um, if not, I'm returning it. <laughs> I didn't say that. Um, so then she punched one more hole. So I was like, look at how many holes there are. There is so many holes. But I don't, like, I don't care. The belt is great. I've been rocking it to death. I love it so very much. To be honest with you. <clears throat> it could use another hole. <laughs> I might go to a leather smith and just have them punch another hole, but I went to Gucci because I'm like, I could trust Gucci and also it was free. So for right now, it fits great, but it could, since I'm losing a little bit of weight, um, I lost 10 pounds recently. Woo, woo, mm -mm. Um, but if I continue, which I'm still working out, I think I'm gonna lose a little bit of weight. I'm gonna need another hole. Gucci, don't be mad. I'm going to come in. I'm going to ask for another hole. Okay. <laughs> I'm ridiculous, but I want what I want. And I'm not going to wait another year for the 70, for the 75. Like I still don't think they ever got it. They had a waiting list. And then the waiting list was like years long or months long. It's like, no, I'm one of those people that I want what I want. I want it now. And so I got it. And I'm happy because I would still be waiting and I'd still be sad. But I got my belt. So she's happy. Now, there was one thing that I got in uh, Dublin that I did not show you guys. And it came, oh geez, in this, let me take this chameleon off, this big, beautiful box. It came in this box and I love her. I love her so much now. Uh, it's been something that I've wanted for a very long time and that I was said I was going to get last year and I didn't get or the year before that and I didn't get it. So I'm just like, no. But as you know, if you know luxury, you know, it always goes up. Why do they do that to us? Why can't they let us live? It kept going up. Everything goes up. Um, but if you travel to Europe, you would know that in Europe, everything's a little bit cheaper. Just so hair so and every every penny counts trust me so i got this lovely baby uh but this video is already getting kind of long so i'm gonna save the unboxing of that for another video so if you'd like to see the wonderful holy grail thing that i got uh watch the other video either way thank you guys so much for sitting here and listening to me for however long this is and seeing all the cool things that I got for my birthday, it was such an amazing time. Uh, I feel blessed and happy and can't wait to celebrate another birthday. Though I, I'm not, I don't think I'm going to go as big as I did last year or the year before. Though I say that every year, but I just am in a place where I'm very happy and content and life is good. So thank you for watching this. That is awesome that you took a time out of your day to be here and watch this video. So thank you guys so very much. I'll see you on the internet, I guess, at some point. Uh, feel free to follow me on um, Instagram, Twitter, if you still do that, Kells Broadway. And uh, I'll see you guys again. Peace out.